2018 will bring some new laws in Michigan. They'll impact everyone from children and parents to police. Yeah, and 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell is in Lansing with a look at some of the changes coming. This is a list of about 200 laws that were passed by lawmakers in 2017. And some of them are going to be going into effect in the coming weeks. Here's a look at some of them. If you take a look at legislation that will soon go into effect, you will see several bills that made big headlines in 2017. House Bill 4716 goes into effect come March. It came after federal prosecutors charged Livonia doctors in connection to the female genital mutilation of young girls. Under the new law, parents who allow this to be done to their children would risk losing their parental rights. Another is Senate Bill 223. It was inspired by this video. In the video, it appears a deputy assaults a man, then he allegedly lied about it. He then was allowed to resign. He wasn't fired. Uh, two weeks later, he had a job at another department. Now he's being sued for three assaults at that department. So I said, this has got to stop. Starting January 15th, law enforcement agencies will have to keep and share a record of why an officer left a job. Now, 99% of all police officers are the best people in the world. You'd love to have one as a neighbor. But every once in a while, as in every profession, you get a bad apple. And we can't have them hopping from department to department to department. Senate Bill 352 becomes law in January. It aims to protect young athletes. It will put in place a new level of training for high school coaches. They will now have to undergo concussion awareness training programs every three years. The programs will be updated by the state as doctors learn better ways to identify and handle concussions. If you want to get a look at what your lawmakers have been doing and see this full list, we'll have it at our website, WXYZ.com. In Lansing, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. Kim. Shalom. First and foremost, I want to get all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Waha, Rakha, Quarash, Barakata. I want to get double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who rule well. And I also want to say peace and salutations to Akim across the four corners of the globe that are out here pushing this gospel in all truthfulness and sincerity. You so-called Negroes, you so-called Latinos, you so-called Native Americans, as well as you confusion of faces who look like the other heathen nations. But really, your seed goes back to one of the uh, 12 tribes of the nation of Israel. Now with that, as you can see, I played this video out about how there were, they said there's over 200 new laws in the state that I am in, in Michigan. My name is Karataza, and I'm from the GMS Detroit camp. Now with that, I just want to get about three precepts that went along with this. So the first precept that I want to get is um, Isaiah. So like yeah, I can bear with me. Uh Khan. This is the book of Isaiah. Chapter ten and verse one. One second, I can. And it reads, Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. So Khan, right. These motherfucking devils done wrote over 200 new laws, man. And they, they so wicked, they only showed you a maybe three laws that they put on the books out of 200. So that's 197 other laws they didn't speak of, and you best believe that those law, the majority of these laws that they made up are against you jakes, man. You so-called Negroes, you so-called Latinos, and you so-called Native Americans, man. As well as you confusion the faces. The laws, these unrighteous decrees are against you. Because, see, Esau is running out of time, man. He, as they say, uh, in the military, it's time to open up the toolbox, boys, which means, shoot, they're about to start lobbing grenades, shooting law rockets at us, literally, and, you know, I'm metaphorically, uh, shoot, about to start using C4. Everything that they got in the toolbox, they finna throw it at us, man. And this is just one of the uh, 
ways that they're going to do it by passing laws that didn't nobody know about against Jake. Now, with that, I want to get my uh, second uh, precept, which is uh, going to be in the book of Zechariah, chapter 11 and verse 5. Con. And it reads, uh, Slaki Akim. Sorry about that. It reads, Whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. Because that's what Esau do, man. He slay us Jakes, man. Us so called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, as well as us confusion of faces. They gun us down in the street. Man, and they don't, they find themselves not guilty. Oh, well, we're going to have, we're going to do an internal investigation. Yeah, they find themselves not guilty. Continue on. And they that sell them say, blessed be the Lord, for I am rich. And their own shepherds pity them not. Because see, this devil, they think that the Most High has forgotten about us. They think that their uh, Psalms 83 one through six has come true, but the Most High have not forgotten us, man. But right now we're still in Esau's kingdom, so he could pass these uh, grievous laws, these unrighteous decrees, man, against the uh, nation of Israel. Con, I want to go back to what this, uh, I don't know if he was a police chief or what. Bear with me, I got to find it. A list of about 200 laws that were passed by lawmakers in 2017 and some 23 it was inspired by this video in the video it appears a deputy assaults a man then he allegedly lied about it he then was allowed to resign he wasn't fired uh two weeks later he had a job at another department now he's being sued for three assaults at that department so i said this has got to stop Starting January. This goddamn devil ain't say this. Oh, so this the one incident where you say it got to stop. Like uh, all the all the other shit, and then it looked like they was fucking up. Uh, a uh, Edomite. You know what I'm saying? He could have been a uh a, a Jake, a confusion of faces. Cause I wholeheartedly believe in the confusion of faces, man. But you know what I'm saying? We we don't know. But anyway, I'm about to get uh, another precept to what this uh, lying ass red pink Edomite devil uh, to go against his bitch ass. So we're going to go to the book of uh, Psalms. Uh, Psalms 34 and verse 3. Kind, and it reads. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born. Speaking lies, man. These Edomite devils, as soon as they start saying, goo goo gag gag, they lying. Bitch, they're crying, little babies. Bitch, you ain't hungry, you lying. But uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to finish playing this video, man. Every 15th. Law enforcement agencies will have to keep and share a record of why an officer left a job. Now, 99% of all police officers are the best people in the world. You'd love to have one. <laughs> Wait, man, let me... <laughs> Salaki, uh, reading again, Psalms 58, verse 3. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be bored, speaking last. Come on, man. This motherfucker just told a bold face laugh, man. Look, look how red he is. Teeth fucked up. All that money you devils got. You can't get your teeth fixed, bitch. Uh, two weeks later, he had a job at another department. Now he's being sued for three assaults at that department. So I said, this has got to stop. Starting January 15th. Law enforcement agencies will have to keep and share a record of why an officer left a job. Now, 99% of all police officers are the best people in the world. You'd love to have one as a neighbor. But every once in a while, as in every profession, you get a bad apple. And we can't have them hopping from department to department to department. Senate Bill 350. That motherfucker lying, man. Anyway, I'm about to get my last precept. We're going to go to the book of Psalms, chapter 10. 
uh, and we're going to start at uh, verse 8, and we're going to probably read down to verse 10, and it reads, He sitteth in the lurking places of the villages, in the secret places do he murder the innocent. His eyes are privily set against the poor. Because is that not what these devils do? They lie in wait trying to catch Jake uh, with his seatbelt off so they can pull him over and blow his brains out. Or not using your blinker so they can pull you over and blow your brains out. Which all goes back to the unrighteous decrees that they set. You know what I'm saying? But like the scriptures just said, woe onto them. That means destruction. And you fucking Edomites, you are about to be destroyed, bitch. As along with you Ishmaelites, you Hamites, you Elamites, you Ammonites, and you Moabites, and the rest of you pieces of shit nations. Continue on on. In verse 9, he lieth in wait secretly as a lion in his den. He lieth in wait to catch the poor. He doeth catch the poor when he draweth him into his net. Kind. With the, how do he catch the poor? With these laws. Man, these laws are set against the poor. Who are the poor people? Man, I just got an a idea for another video. But who are the poor? The poor are you is are the Israelites, you so called Negroes, you so called Latinos, you so called Native Americans, as well as you confusion the faces, and I'ma keep drilling at home who the nation of Israel is, man. Uh, Khan, continue on at verse 10. He croucheth and humbleth himself that the poor may fall by his strong ones. That's just like this bitch. He gonna, uh, this fork tongue motherfucker gonna say, This shit got to stop, but 99% of the uh police. You would want them as a neighbor. No, the fuck I wouldn't want no police officer. For, I had, I used to live by a police officer. But anyway, you know, I want to keep it uh scriptural. I used to live right next door to a police officer. But anyway, hopefully this uh video epistle uh, was edifying to the hopeful elect. And to those of you who may have come across it who are learning as well as I am. So with that, I want to say, call Haloyim. Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai. Waha Rakha Kodash Barakata. I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who taught me this truth. And I also want to give a sincere peace and salutations to you, Akim, across the four corners of the globe that are out here pushing this gospel in our truthfulness and sincerity. Man, keep pushing. Baba Kashak, stay in the spirit. Keep making uh, videos because y'all videos help. Us other Akim out. You know what I'm saying? Iron sharp if iron. And with that, I want to say Shalom.